Hey, what's going on guys? Mess of the Reverts here. Today I'm going to be starting up a new series on the channel called Craft or Pass. And originally I wanted to do this series with some of the weapon variants in the game. And I still might do this if you guys really want me to. But uh, basically in this series I'm going to be letting you guys know if a Scorchic variant is good enough for you to craft. Or actually pass on it instead and you know just save your salvage. So for the first episode we're going to be looking at the Epic Counter UAV Nova. And it comes with the perk Blast. And the description reads, on entry all enemy equipment and Scorchics are destroyed. But kind of the downfall of running the Nova is uh, it's gonna cost you a bit more to earn and it's 1150 score which is 50 more than the Warden so basically the uh, epic UAV acts like a system hack in a way or an EMP where your heads-up display is kind of disoriented but this only stays like it for a little bit maybe for like a second if that and of course you are gonna lose your mini map and you're gonna notice in the gameplay on screen that I'm using the epic Nova in the mayhem playlist where players are getting a lot of score streaks and you're gonna see that every time they call in something really really big or just a plethora of score score streaks I'm basically going to be using this Nova and uh, taking them all down and getting a bunch of score that way which will replenish my score a bit more. Now what I'm also doing here is combining the counter UAV Nova with the uh, combat focus trait for my warfighter rig so uh, you're going to see here that I get a ton of score when I activate the combat focus first and then the counter UAV because it's going to destroy all the score streaks of course and the equipment as well and uh, by doing so I'm going to be getting a lot more score basically whatever I was going to get originally it's going to be doubled with the uh, combat focus trait and of course I'm going to be using hardline too which makes it a bit easier for me to get the counter UAV Nova uh, like I said it does take 1150 score which is 50 more than the warden so it is a little bit hard to get but uh, if you're gonna be playing mayhem then it's really really easy to get and of course you are gonna complete a lot of challenges by doing this little trick because uh, there are some score sheet challenges that uh, do take a while to get because you know say for like destroying the apex or uh, maybe like the RCA it does take a while to do but you can't actually get these challenges completed with the uh, counter UAV strategy so uh, very very good strategy they like to use and also guys if y'all didn't know there is going to be a drop zone uh, variant playlist coming out soon I think sometime this week maybe tomorrow I'm not really sure or today now guys aside from the mayhem playlist and the variant drop zone playlist that's going to be coming out today I do feel that the Nova is definitely worth the salvage because it is very tactical to use because say if you're playing like a domination game mode and somebody calls in a warden then you can basically just get rid of that uh, high powered streak with the Nova or maybe if they're going to call it an Apex or a Thor so uh, just I do feel that the Nova is a very good streak to run if you're going to be one of those air support guys. Now if you do struggle getting the Warden then I would maybe not consider buying the Nova but it actually could help you out mentally if you run a streak higher than the Warden so maybe the Apex or an RC8. So again guys I do feel that the Nova is definitely worth the salvage but I want y'all to tell me what you think about this down in the comments. Also if you want me to do this series for weapon variants I'd be more than happy to just let me know down in the comments and also drop a like if y'all did enjoy and thank you guys so much for watching i'm a vert to the day till next time I'll catch you guys later